Hey guys, thanks so much for coming to my channel. Uh, my name's Amber and I am leaving for basic training tomorrow. I'm super excited. I'm kind of nervous, but um, I'm more like, well, I'm excited like I can't wait, but I'm also kind of, I'm just nervous for the unknown. So today I'm gonna go over my packing and what I packed in my bag. And hopefully it really helps someone because YouTube has helped me so much in so many ways. And it's something that I wanted to create was a positive YouTube channel sharing something that I'm super passionate about. And for me to document this journey and knowing that I'm putting my story out there and it's going to probably help someone. And that's like the biggest... Um, compliment ever so I really hope that this channel can help people out there who are searching for answers who um, can't find it somewhere else or that just need extra support so we're gonna start All right. okay so I got this this is my list for what to bring which is literally one of everything one underwear one jeans one shirt two sports bras, um, $50 of cash. Really, it's not much. And I was thinking, ah, oh, there's other things I should probably bring. So I'm going to go over my, my bag and show you what I brought. Okay, guys, don't go to Academy. Don't go to wherever and get yourself a bag. I got this at a thrift store for $15. It's Adidas. You can get almost anything from a thrift store that I got some Merle, Merle hiking boots, Merle, that would originally cost a hundred, a hundred fifty dollars. I got it for ten dollars. Yeah. Okay. So right here I have packed is my important documents such as my birth certificate, my, um, all the documents that you, they gave you in maps. And a key note I would do with all of these documents is I would download Adobe Scanner and take a picture of those 50 pages and, and it has it saved in that app. So when you're in reception or years from now when you want to look back at the paperwork, you already have it on your phone. So when they say, oh, I lost your paperwork. Oh, no, you didn't. I have it. So that would be perfect for you to... Um, take an Adobe um, scan, Adobe scan app, and scan the pictures, scan the phone, scan the, scan the documents. Okay. Okay, I also brought a calendar because I want to be marking the days to kind of know, get an idea of what day it is. I'm bringing a small journal. In this journal, I already have pre-stamped letters, envelopes, I mean. I have my emergency contacts. I have um, addresses. I also have other important information. And then I'm also going to write down, I have US, Canada, and I printed out all of the bases that um, the Army has to offer and I'm going to list the bases because it's so it's so much and I I honestly I don't know where I want to be based and if they're like oh you gotta put down your bases and I'm like uh, what so I'm, I'm kind of nervous about that because I want to pick a really good base in an area that I know that I would be happy in if if I get that choice Okay, alright, so I have my nice um, tampons. I only packed enough for like a couple of months uh, because I know I'll, I'll be able to get some more. Right in here is foot stuff, so I have insoles just in case I need it with the boots. I also bought this at CVS, it's called a manscaping. 
No, I'm not a man, but it has scissors so I can cut any type of flyaways or whatever that goes wrong with my uniform. Um, travel appropriate scissors and it has tweezers as well as um, nail clippers. Um, and then I have some band-aids. I also have some blister preventative. It's not moleskin, but it's very similar to moleskin. Um, right now, with all the shelves being pretty much wiped, I couldn't find anything for moleskin or, or band-aids. This was the closest thing I found. Oh, they're also going to be taking your bag and dumping it out. So everything I have is in baggies. And I just reused like things that I had at the house. Right here I have an eye mask, a sleep mask at night and earplugs. I also have a mirror, a compact mirror. You can't see it. And then Dermax, this is kind of miscellaneous. And I got these bags um, on Amazon. They were like $15, they're silicone, they're reusable. You can use them for food, they can get dirty, they can kinda, you know. They're just really nice. This right here is my shower stuff. Okay, this is just cleansing wipes um, for your face when I don't have those days that I get to take a shower or whatever happens. And here, I'm gonna go ahead and open it. And here I just reused an empty um, container that I put hair scrunchies and um, bobby pins in. And I'm also gonna add some safety pins. This right here is just a small sample um, can from Lush. And this has my hair gel in it. I didn't bring a lot of hair scrunchies just because my hair is super short and it, um, I don't have to put it up. But we'll see what they say. I'm afraid that my bangs might be. Sometimes I have bangs, sometimes I don't because I'm just like, okay. This right here, shower. Honestly, just like to carry with me and put wherever. Or I'm just gonna use a plastic bag. A dollar. And then I just used hotel shampoos, conditioners, and washes, and then I have a razor in there. Right here I have some Sharpies, highlighters, a pen, just so I can mark up, write things in my journal, and then, <coughs> sorry, and then mark on my bags. This I put my money in. I also have a charger. And then I brought this portable thing just in case I, um, my phone is low on battery and I just need to charge it on the plane there, plane somewhere else. I don't really think I need it, but um, why not? This right here is a deodorant. I have lotion, sunscreen, and guys, I brought, <laughs> I put some lotion in here. It is lotion, but it's kind of like um, baby powder. It's called Fresh Balls, and it's lotion that you put on, like, you know, like crevices, like, your underarm, the backs of your knees, and it turns into powder. <laughs> so hopefully, hopefully I can break that. I don't, I don't think, I mean, it doesn't say what it is, but you know what? I don't know because I leave tomorrow and then I'll figure out. I'll let you know later. Okay. This, I put my makeup stuff in, um, I'll just put this in my civilian bag when I get there. This is just for graduation. This right here is all my mouth. Um, 
morning and night care. And I have eye drops as well as Q-tips. I think it's really important to bring Q-tips because your ears are going to get kind of dirty. And um, yeah, other places might get dirty as well where you might need Q-tips. So. Um, this is just pajamas for the first couple of nights. Not, not much. I brought a Jesus Calling book. Hopefully they'll let me be able to read that when I can. And then in here, I brought, um, which is underwear and socks. I bought these sports bras from Burlington and Walmart. So, really, I wanted something that was medium support. That was cheap because sports bras can be a good um, 30 bucks. They really can. So check your Burlington Coat Factory check. Uh, you can check Plata's Closet, but that might be kind of expensive. You can check Goodwill, but I just decided to get these. And that is it. That's really it. Yeah. Another side note, what I did was I started packing for AIT. So when my parents come to see me for graduation, they can bring the stuff that's in there because I will be in Fort Meade, Maryland, and it's going to get cold around the time that I'm getting there. So I packed boots and jackets and just other activities that I can do when I'm not studying for my job. So that is it, and I leave tomorrow, and wow. Uh, if if y'all really like this video, please let me know if I'm new, so I'm learning, okay? I'll just say that. Uh, I used to be a flight attendant um, before this, as well as a substitute teacher, so I got lots of stories and um, this is kind of a mid-career decision for me. Something that I've wanted to do since high school and I was just always held back. And maybe that can be like a different story for another time. But I just hope this reaches someone and makes them feel like, wow, I can do that too. Or wow, that's a great idea. Or, like, wow, you're not going to get away with that. <laughs> Alright, okay, well, I hope you really enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like. Leave a comment. If you made it all the way to the end, leave a comment. Okay, this is going to be my last night to spend the night in this, in this comfy bed. Alright, okay. Well, y'all have a wonderful day, a wonderful time getting ready for whatever chapter of life you're in. Uh, so till next time, bye.